Beatmaker is the squad. What's good? It's your boy Cheese, the producer. How would you like to take your koala sampler and take it from looking like this to this? Today I'm going to show you how. Let's get into it. All right, so the first thing you want to do is find yourself a picture that you would like to have as your background for Koala Sampler. Once you've found that picture, you should size it and make it the orientation that you want. I'm doing this on my phone, and since it only goes portrait, I'll just leave it in this orientation. Once you have it the way you want it, snap a screenshot. Then tap the screenshot and hit the share icon. Once you're in this menu, go to save to files. In here, you want to navigate to the Koala folder and then tap where it says PNG image and clear the name and simply type the letters BG with no spaces. Hit done and hit save. At this point, you can choose to delete the screenshot or keep it. It really doesn't even matter. Now we're going to go over to the computer. On the computer, we're going to open up iTunes, and in iTunes, what you're going to do is you're going to click on the icon that corresponds to your iOS device. And here, you're going to click File Sharing, and then navigate to Koala. Let it load for a second, and you'll see all the documents pop up from your Koala folder. You'll see bg.png there. I have one on my desktop from when I did it with my iPad, so I'm going to delete it. Now I'm simply going to take this file, I'm going to drag it to my desktop, and now I'm just going to drag it right back on. It's going to ask me if I want to replace it, just hit replace for now, and at this point you're done. Now I normally don't use iTunes, I normally use iFunbox, so I'm going to show you how to do the same thing in iFunbox right now. So in iPhone box, you want to go to App File Sharing, navigate to Koala, and you'll see on the screen, you'll see the bg.png. So I'm going to delete it from my desktop as I did before, drag it to the desktop, then I'm going to drag it back in. iPhone box won't ask you if, it wants to, if you want to replace it, but just replace it. At this point, you're done. So let's go back to the phone. Now let's open up Koala Sampler, and there's our new background. Now I'm sure at some point in the future you'll want to change your background up, so all you have to do is literally follow the same process, but this time you don't have to use the computer. So snap the screenshot, hit the share icon, save the files, title it BG. And now save it in your Koala folder, hit replace, choose to delete or save the screenshot if you want. Now open up Koala. And there's your new background. Now in order for your new background to take, you will have to actually close Koala and reopen it. But other than that, it's just that easy. It's your boy Cheese the producer, and I'm signing off for Beatmakers the Squad. Peace.